Well, uh, we have a good new year because new year news, because there are many vaccines already prepared for be uh, used, shipped and used uh, against SARS-CoV-2. What uh, SARS-CoV-2? Sorry. <laughs> what is uh, what is the vaccine? It is came. The name is coming from uh, Italian vaca cow, which is. Uh, has been used as a, as a first uh, inoculation of uh, Yenner Sun, which has been uh, um, inoculated and then after uh, infection, in, in, experimentally infected with the variola virus after he received uh, the first uh, bovine variola uh, vaccine, which was a vaccine, and this is the name of Vaca vaccine, uh, came, came from this, uh, this uh, animal, Italian name. Well, uh, Latin name, well, scientific, uh, science, science use Latin. Uh, well, uh, uh, everybody knows what's, uh, well, that in 11th of January, the Chinese, uh, the Chinese laboratory, genetic laboratory, one Chinese genetic laboratory gave information uh, for this uh, virus, the initial form of this virus. And then after this lab has been closed. Uh, this information has been used uh, for many others, like a, uh, DNA printing or RNA printing, that depends, and uh, has been used to, to establish vaccines. There are different, uh, different approaches. First of all, this is this uh, Pfizer and Moderna approach, which is, which is a nanoparticle, lipid nanoparticle, which, which has been used uh, as a carrier for, uh, for the, this genetic information uh, after it has been printed. The, RNA uh, uh, spike protein uh, correspondent and uh, this has been is in, introduced into the body and the cells is uh, using this information through the proteic, uh, proteic uh, 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 synthesis uh, pathway to produce uh, proteins and these proteins they are spike like proteins they are used uh, used for for uh, uh, autoimmunization this is this is actually auto vaccine not a real vaccine it's auto vaccine because it's giving to the organism the information to produce locally the protein which is considered to to, to be the antigen and this is the vaccine the protein locally produced interesting uh, the same way is working uh, it's uh, it's working the the other kind of vaccines which are using a carrier a vector it's a virus which is a guinea pig virus. It has an experimental virus used on virology for many years. And this big virus, adenovirus, is producing a, a, a small cough, like a small flu-like syndrome. And this, uh, this vaccine, this virus is, uh, has been modified in two directions. First direction to introduce uh, through CRISPR uh, a uh, information genetic material DNA in this case for the spike protein and also the uh, Oxford laboratory has uh, uh, managed to castrate to, to neuter this virus in order to not make, make him uh, uh, capable of, uh, of uh, being replicated which is, uh, is uh, very safe they, the, the lab the Oxford lab used uh, um, a chimp uh, virus because this this vector should be should be not uh, not uh, known not should should be not encountered in uh, in the uh, our immunitary system. I mean uh, we should not have uh, uh, seen this virus before. Uh, immunity against it it is compromising the the vaccine. Well, uh, this is the case. They use it the chimp virus. Other are using other adenovirus very very uh, seldom seen in the human population. Twenty six, for example, or number five, the Russian from Gamaleya Institute. Uh, well, they they made this uh, this vaccine. It's, it's uh, available many many months ago. Maybe from June July. Maybe for uh, uh, for September already. But uh, they have to fulfill all the tests, the animal test, the human test, and the, the large scale human test. This uh, AstraZeneca, because AstraZeneca is it's uh, behind the Oxford laboratory with uh, with uh, money involved, and uh, this they are they are uh, uh, NGO style vaccine. Uh, I mean uh, they don't uh, counter any profit on this. This is the reason it's uh, ten times cheaper than the Pfizer uh, counterpart or the Moderna counterpart. The Moderna and Pfizer it is around thirty three uh, dollars, and this uh, this one. Uh, this uh, friendly one from Oxford, it is only three dollars. 
Well, it's produced in India. It's producing 30 locations in the world. And the capacity is 3 billion doses for 2021. Big capacity. Uh, has been approved uh, yesterday on 30 of, uh, of December by the British authorities. It's waiting to be approved by the European authorities and the American ones. The American ones, they have the, the, the Moderna, which is, a, how can I say, a national vaccine. Like uh, the money involved there are from uh, the National Health Institute. Also, together with the Moderna company, Moderna Money. And also they have the Pfizer vaccine, which is uh, 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 also an uh, American company, as far as we know. And uh, this, uh, this uh, uh, Oxford vaccine, it's, uh, it's coming, it's coming, but in many countries they need it. They will produce it even in China and Russia. They are producing in Argentina, they are producing, uh, will be produced in Mexico, uh, in uh, many European countries, in Germany, Holland, uh, Brits, of course, and the uh, uh, United States, Canada. But they will produce in China, even in China and Russia, which is, which is very interesting because they... they they uh, show the, in this way they they don't have any politics in in behind them. They just they just uh, uh, want to to cover the immunity, the herd immunity of the human population, which is very nice. Uh, there is a third ki th third kind. No, there is a fourth kind. There are two more kinds of vaccines. There is an inactivated vaccines which has been used since July in China. The China, there are two two uh, big institutes, the there's, there's Sinovac and Sinopharm. Sinovac is private and Sinopharm is state-owned. And Sinopharm has two laboratories in Wuhan and in Beijing. They produce uh, uh, three inact inactivated vaccines and they are using uh, these vaccines since July for uh, uh, people in risk. Two, uh, maybe two million doses, maybe more than two million doses has been uh, produced. Uh, nobody knows what, uh, what's, what happens in China stays in China. Only when they want to sell from China, they go. Anyway, uh, this, uh, this, in this, in this way, with an inactivated vaccine, they, they, it's an old style vaccine, but it's, uh, it's a virus inactivated and physically inactivated and in the, introduced by uh, by injection. It is, uh, it is used uh, many years ago. It is uh, even today the flu vaccine. It's an inactivated one. We are uh, inoculated. Uh, Inoculating in India mostly uh, embryos, chicken embryos, by millions, kill them by millions, and uh, receive the virus. And this virus we are inactivated, put it in the virus, and this is the, the flu vaccine. And uh, uh, in, in, this is the same uh, way of the China one. I don't know why why they didn't uh, start to do this one in uh, whole the world because look what happens in China. There are almost no almost no infections. In, uh, there are 250 days in Taiwan, only two infections. They have uh, two pilots came there and and uh, they they has uh, was tested positive. 250 days with no infections. I, that's for sure they they was using these vaccines. Well, what else? Uh, what else is the fourth one? The fourth vaccine it is a protein. You remember that I told you about the protein which is produced locally through the genetic information gave by the, the message RNA vaccines or the adenovirus vaccines. Well, there is another path. It's a simple one, very effective. I will tell you, tell you why. It is the protein path because you just give the protein, which is a spike-like protein. A spike as a spike is the, 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 pro, the, the part of the virus which is uh, very important because it uh, it's, uh, 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 get, gets to the cell to the receptors, the ACA2 receptors. Well, this, uh, this uh, um, protein, it is used in uh, terms of immunization through different ways. Even uh, nasal uh, installation is an even, uh, you, can put, you can put eye droplets in, uh, in, uh, in this case with this protein. It is, it is uh, for sure the, the next uh, the next phase or the next step of creating vaccines. It is so simple. Just produce a protein. Of course, being an allogenic protein, it can produce anaphylactic uh, forms, but you can go through to the, to the uh, nasal or digestive or uh, different mucosas just to, just to vaccinate uh, locally, which is extremely 
clever. Well, this uh, uh, Novavax from uh, from United States, they are producing already ordered in India. Uh, I've told you maybe uh, India is the biggest uh, the biggest uh, uh, vaccine producers in the world. But I have I think they have forty percent of the market, and uh, this uh, protein it is. Uh, it is produced by it is tried to be produced by many other companies or even a chinese company cancino it's uh, trying to produce a protein which is uh, uh, a way of uh, of vaccinated even the flu virus it is existing uh, but is a different kind uh, uh, also a nasal installation form the flu virus you just put it in uh, just put it into the, your nose but in this case, it's an attenuated, uh, attenuated virus. It is a live one, not a protein. Well, this is, this is uh, 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 what we are expecting. We are expected, uh, expecting uh, this Oxford vaccine, which is CH from chimpanzee, AD from adenovirus, and Ox from Oxford uh, name. And one, because it's the first one. I think they are already preparing the second one. Uh, the second one, which is matching better uh, the actual uh, the actual uh, uh, corona uh, uh, virus strain, even even with the British and South American uh, uh, modification, the 501 location of the pro of uh, the one of the three protein from Spike, which is uh, modified from asparagine to tyrosine, um, and the. Uh, they will come with two, <laughs> the two variant. Well, uh, we have good signs from New Year's. Just have to wait a little bit.